The speculation of the big move to Egypt by Percy Tau has been a topical one for months now, but without concrete confirmation. At the beginning of the European season two weeks ago, English side Brighton & Hove Albion had included Percy Tau in their squad, and suddenly there was doubt whether the move was ever going to happen. But Tau has been sitting on the sidelines for much of his tenure in Europe, compounding his frustrations. I signed with Brighton, then I got loaned for many years. Then they brought me back. Why would I want to go out again? So, I want to stay. I want to play. That's where I stand. That's where the club stands. Is that they want me to stay and fight for my position. Unless something happens from now until that day, there's not enough time to show myself. We are training depending on when we play. So, trainings were shorter. The games come on the bench. <laughs> but I heard some good news. I think he will not stay in Brighton and he will go to an Egyptian team um, with uh, the South African coach Pitsu, Al Ali. So, I think in the next days it will be done and then he will have a chance to play. So, um, there will be a problem less for the future. It's not the same. Speaking to the SABC when announcing his World Cup qualifying squad for Qatar next year, Bruce all but confirmed Dow's move from Brighton. No, uh, we sent an invitation for, uh, for Percy to Brighton and uh, 30 minutes later we had the answer of Brighton that uh, Percy Dow is not anymore a player of Brighton. So then we took information and uh, we know, I think, now for the moment that uh, he's in Egypt to uh, negotiate uh, the last details uh, of uh, transfer. On his social media account, Tau has also removed Brighton & Hove as his current football club. Whilst that can serve as confirmation that Tau has severed all ties with the English club, what is not clear is whether his move to the Red Devils of Egypt is on a permanent or a loan contract. What is certain, though, is that Tau is at the Al Ahli Wal Assalam Stadium in Cairo and training in the colours of the current African club champions. Tabi Sositola, SABC News.